I hope you had a great 4th of July. So on July 5th, I was reading an, a book that probably many of us know by Sarah Young, um, it's entitled Jesus Calling. And I have read this book through for the last two or three years, and I continue to find little gems in there that bless me and encourage me. And last night as I was reading, this is what came up. Draw near to me with a thankful heart. Aware that your cup is overflowing with blessings. Receive that by faith. Your cup is overflowing with blessings. Gratitude. Let that word sink in. Gratitude enables you per to perceive more clearly what he is doing. And to rejoice in the love relationship he desires with you. Nothing, say nothing, nothing can separate you from his loving presence. That is the basis of your security. You feel insecure sometimes or you're floundering or you wonder if I've done enough or haven't done enough. Give all that stuff up. That's just human flesh human behavior that's walking by the law, not by the Spirit. Be led by the Spirit and you'll fulfill the law of the Spirit. So don't be separated from His presence because that is the basis of your security. Whenever you start to feel anxious, remind yourself that security rests in Him alone and he is totally trustworthy. You will never be in control of your life circumstances. Get that, that's important because we try to control to make things work out well. Give it up. You will never be in control of your life circumstances, but you can relax and trust in God's control, totally. Instead of striving for a predictable or desirable lifestyle, seek to know God in a greater way, in a greater depth, in a greater breadth. There's nothing richer. I long to make your life glorious, a glorious adventure, but you must stop clinging to your old ways. Okay, let's give it up today. We stop. We stop clinging to old things, old ways of thinking, old patterns of behaving. Well, I always did it this way and it worked out well. He's wanting to teach you a higher way, a better way. So let's give up the old way and start fresh with the new. He says, I am always doing something new within my beloved ones. And you're a beloved one, even though you might even doubt it from time to time. You're, you're his beloved. And he's doing a fresh, wonderful, exciting, exhilarating work in your life. Be on the lookout for all that I have prepared for you. So right now we join together and we say, yes, we are on the lookout. We're expectant. We're pressing in. We're peering in. We want to see. We want the fullness. Our arms are open wide. Our hearts are open wide. Our minds are open to God and not all that stuff that wants to run through our thought life. No, our eyes are on heaven. We're open to receive everything God has to give us. It's only good you can trust him. Let's trust him today.